Yo, what is up people? My name is Bernie and I would like to welcome you guys to a brand new Minecraft survival series. This is on a server called Hopeless Adventures. It's a semi-vanilla server and we are actually looking for people to join. So if you're interested, uh, click on the link in the description. It is whitelisted so you're going to have to send in an application. But if you enjoy building and spending time on Minecraft then definitely um, submit an application. So, I'd like to welcome you guys to this. It's going to be basically a fresh start for me I have spent a bit of time on this server already um, I, I have made myself a house but I've decided to start over and um, share my my experience with you guys so first thing you can see is this hopeless adventure sign which is quite impressive this was built by a guy called Creed and um, must have taken a lot of time first thing I'm gonna do though is I'm gonna head into OFC grab myself some chicken Obviously, the first thing I'm going to need is food, so that kind of helps me out. So, this area is the main island. It's pretty well populated, and there isn't really space to build over here. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to head over to a place called Nazgul. This is one of the, the many warps on the server. And, um, yeah, basically you can warp into these different areas of the map. The map has been expanded quite extensively recently, so and it's creeper. Um, so there are a lot of new places to build. Okay. What I'm going to do though is I'm going to make my way over to this side of Nazgul. It's, it's a huge castle which um, must have taken ages to build. But I'm going to head my way over around this side in the back and basically not very much building has taken place over here so um, that's where I'm going to hopefully set up camp for this first episode so first thing I'm going to need to do is get some wood and start making myself some wooden tools so I can start getting some stone and getting myself a full set of stone tools I was going to go and kill those pigs, but I have obviously got quite a lot of chicken, which is a good head start, so I don't have to spend too much time doing that. So yeah, there's about a consistent amount of um, 10 of us who put in some time on the server, um, but the server does actually have the capacity for about 100 people, so it would be great to see some, um, some more people, ooh, that was lucky, some more people on the server. Um, and yeah, we've got quite a strong community. I did. I joined about half a year ago, but exams and stuff. I haven't spent much time. Okay. Well, obviously it's the morning at the moment. It's just been sunrise, so the mobs are all still around. Okay. So let's get this crafting table down, make some sticks, and make a pickaxe so I can start getting myself some stone. I'll just break this in my hand. There we go. So if you guys um, would like to have a bit of an input, obviously I'm not going to set up my, my main home in this first episode. Um, just leave a comment in the comment section saying where you think would be the best sort of place for me to build. I'll grab some free sugar cane, that'll be useful in the future. Um, I'm thinking of possibly building into the side of a, a mountain maybe. My my original house on this server is on the top of a hill. Um, it was it was a good house, but I want to um, do something a bit more original and um, personal this time. So building into the side of a house, I think, would be good. So I'm just going to try and grab some stone at the moment and start making myself a set of stone tools. There we go. That should be enough for the time being. I guess I could just build into here, but I think I want. To Go and do a bit more exploring. So, there we go. Stone pickaxe. Need some more sticks. Let's make a stone sword and maybe a stone axe. I don't think I'll be needing a shovel at the moment just because I'm going to be having a look around, seeing where would be the best place to build. I don't want to build in a forest just because it's quite unpersonal and not very um, obvious to see from a long distance. I kind of I want somewhere nice and substantial okay so I have actually previously had a look around this sort of area and there are some 
kind of mountainous areas which look like the sort of place that I'd be interested in, in building in. But uh, I'm open to any kind of suggestions. I think the main thing I do need to do is start going to get some iron and just setting up camp. So for the time being, I'm just going to um, dig my way into here, put a crafting table down and um, just set this up as a temporary sort of home and then I'm going to walk down this, I should just punish this with my hand, I'm going to walk down in this sort of cave area and see if I can find myself some iron because that would be a, a great way to start off, just grab some iron and start developing my equipment and stuff. Okay, so I thought I picked up the crafting table, maybe I didn't. There we go, oh, there's not a big problem, I'll just make another one. Um, I will I will make a shovel just because I'm sure it'll be helpful. Okay, I'm going to make myself another pickaxe because I know you, you use them so quickly. They obviously haven't got great durability. So let's head down here. I think I did see some coal. This guy's not expecting. There we go. So yeah, I'll get some coal, grab some torches. Okay, this wasn't exactly much of a cave. I can't break that block here. I must be close to someone's home. Well, maybe, maybe there is a um, a building around here somewhere. Very well hidden. I know that um, the the guy who actually runs the server is called Yude. And um, he has built a huge underground area, so maybe that's around here. Well, okay. So, bit of a uh, false head start there. Let's try and work our way over in this direction, see if we can find anything. Well, that was surprising. I didn't expect that to happen. I thought we were in the middle of nowhere and nothing was built around here. So... I don't want to head too far away from everyone, but I can probably, into the future, set up a, another system, um, which will mean... Oh, looks like someone else has been around here. If I can set up another system, um, it won't be too hard to travel back to spawn. We have got slash spawn as well. I mean, if I want to travel to people's houses, I'll just link up uh, with the nether, which will make stuff a bit easier. So, I think this looks like the right kind of place. I'll head over here, see if I can start looking at something a bit quaint, set up a, a temporary home and then go exploring just to see if there are any areas that look really interesting. Okay, so I like this kind of um, this forest, this dark oak I think it is. Let's grab some of this because we might use it. I should cut this all the way down, but just because a stone axe is so slow, I'm just going to... Okay, there we go. And there's our first bit of iron that we can use. So what's that? One, two, three, four, five, six. So let's we can start smelting that up soon and um, start making some iron tools, which is perfect. Oh, <laughs> what am I doing? I can't quite get up there. Okay, and this is why I'm not very good at parkour. Okay, this is quite dense. I don't know if this is the sort of place I'd like to build just because it's it's got so many trees that even if you build a huge house in this sort of area, you wouldn't be able to see it. It might be worth it might be worth just setting up a little place and then um, mining downwards just to get some more ores and materials that I could use, and then. Once I've got armour and so on, I can start actually exploring without having to worry about um, being killed by mobs, really. You know, what would be quite substantial would be to get some diamonds in the first episode. I'm not sure how long we've been going for. I was thinking of maybe making this about 20 minutes long. So, okay, yes, wow. Now that is very densely populated with trees. Wow, okay. So the plan at the moment is just to build a little place, um, I'm just going to put down here, just a little place to store my stuff, 
and then I'm going to head downwards, go to a, hopefully a, a lower area and just grab myself some ores. I'd like to get some iron armour and so on. So let's make a furnace. Oh no, I'm being an idiot. I need to get my crafting table down. Let's just put that over here. Make a furnace. I haven't got enough. Damn it. Okay, we've got some here at least. Um, and yeah, and then I can start smelting this iron. I actually haven't got any... I just realised I haven't got any coal, but I can just use the wood that I picked up earlier. There we go. So I'll let that smelt. I'll have a quick look around here. But it doesn't look like anything. I'll grab these mushrooms just because in the future when I am um, making weakness potions for villagers, they'll be helpful. Okay. So it looks like it's going to start getting to night time, so it may be worth heading down now. I'm just going to make myself an iron pickaxe and um, an iron sword. And then I can start heading downwards and actually trying to get some ores. So there we go. Enough to make a pickaxe. Oh, I haven't got enough sticks. There we go. So let's make a pickaxe and a sword. And then we'll be set to go and do a bit of mining. Perfect. Oh. Let's just split that in half. Okay. So now it's going to night time. I think it would be safer to go downwards. It might be worth making myself an iron shovel. But actually there won't be much dirt. I'll be straight into the pickaxe. Okay. And so it begins. Hopefully I'll find some coal down here. It might be slightly dark for you guys. Maybe this was a bad idea because I'm... There's quite a big chance that I'm not going to find any coal. And I can't hardly see anything myself. Okay, bad idea. Let's head back up. See if we can find some coal in this uh, mountainside. I'll have a look around here. Alright, the spider's coming from here already. I need to get that uh, iron sword in my hotbar. There we go. Okay, this is the problem with uh, these sort of biomes that isn't much um, exposed rock face so it's not likely that you're going to find any iron and I haven't got any armour for myself either so I don't want to be running around with a lot of mobs around um, it's going to be quite dangerous maybe I headed in the wrong direction just maybe ok so I think I'm going to head, 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 head over to this mountainside over here oh these mobs hit hard when I have no armor okay yep I won't be needing the furnace and the uh, crafting table I can easily make those again so I'm gonna oh witch already I'm gonna work my way over here that is one of the worst things about forest as well just all of the mobs let's try and get up here see if we can get a vantage point and have a look around the area Creeper's coming for me already. I just didn't knock him back quite far. Okay. I'm so used to having depth strider. It feels so slow in the water. Okay, so let's work our way up here. Okay. So. We've got a bit of a rock face over there. It doesn't look like there's any coal over there. I can take that falling damage. Okay, I think I'm going to head over here. It looks somewhat interesting. It would be somewhat protected from mobs if I built in the water or in this um, base for the time being. Okay, well we can grab ourselves some stone. Maybe there will be some coal over here. It's annoying that I couldn't grab that coal earlier because that been, would have been quite helpful. But... Um, there you go, someone had obviously built around there. This might be a little bit dark for you guys. Let's see if I can just put my brightness all the way up. Um, yeah, I am all the way up with brightness. So this is the best it's going to get. Maybe I'll find something. Okay, I don't know why I'm digging this too wide. Um, I should be able to find some coal down here. It's 
not looking too successful at the moment. I just realised I did actually leave one iron ingot back in the furnace, which is a bit stupid of me. But I just needed to get out of that area because it was night time and was absolutely full of mobs already. We are not doing too well at the moment. The durability of this is going down quite far. It's not looking promising, guys. This might be a bit of a letdown. Wait, what level am I at? 38. Okay, wow, we're very high still. I'm surprised we haven't uh, mined into a cave yet, though. Okay, finally. There we go, some coal. That's perfect, just what we needed. Now I can start making some torches. Well, actually, I'm going I'm to make a couple right now, just because... It's obviously quite dark for you guys. There we go, that'll do for the time being. There we go. Nice and bright again. So let's grab all of this coal. And then keep going downwards. It'd be nice to find some more iron on the way down here as well. Well, loads and loads of coal. I guess coal does usually spawn with lots and lots of... Uh, but there's always loads of it, isn't there, when you find it, so that's perfect. Now we need to find a cave and hopefully find ourselves some more iron on the way down. How are we doing? There we go, perfect, some more iron. We are on level 29, so that's great. Can we get another torch down? So, yeah, guys, within the... Um, the upcoming episodes I'm hopefully going to be showing you I'm going to you know establish my house get myself some gear and um, hopefully some diamonds um, and then I can give you guys a bit of a, a server tour um, there are loads and loads of things going on the server there's usually kind of weekly competition where you can win things and that's usually related to building um, okay I'm going to set myself a furnace up here I haven't even got enough wood Okay, well, we've achieved what we wanted to achieve. We've got a lot of iron. I'm going to head up, grab myself some wood. Um, let's smelt all of this iron that we've got. And then, make sure I eat up so I regen my health. Um, and then we can come back down, mine some more of that coal and iron that we found. And um, keep heading down, hopefully, and find some, some caves. Okay, so it's still nighttime outside, which is... It's a bit dangerous, but this area that we found is actually quite good. I might have to set up my place around here. I don't want to make this too long just because of um, upload times. My internet is it's okay, not the best though. So, yeah, I'm going to probably finish off in a few minutes. I'm just going to grab some of this, head back down, wait until we find a cave, and then I'm going to have to end up. So, well, let's just... Um, Make that into planks. Okay. So, at least we managed to find some um, coal and iron eventually. Pretty dark. I'll put a couple of torches down here. There we go. So, we are getting quite low towards the bottom. So, um, we should hopefully be in kind of cave finding area. Okay, let's make a crafting table, make a furnace. Now we've got some coal so we can start properly smelting some um, some of this iron. Okay, let's just put that up there. Iron in, there's my coal. Perfect. So yeah, this, this iron pickaxe is almost broken. It's got a few more uses in it. Actually, have I got that um, 58 more uses? There we go. Let's actually just grab some more torches. Oh, I put all of my coal back up here. Um, I'll take three, that'll do. Um, make some more sticks. And then make some more torches. Perfect. Okay. So I can't really can't believe we haven't found a cave yet. It's quite unlucky. What biome are we in actually? Plains. So, 
I'm surprised we haven't found anything. I'm sure we will do in a couple of minutes. Okay. Well, we've got lapis before we found a cave. I um, There we go. I don't know what I'll be using lapis for yet because I haven't got anything to enchant, but... That's great. Hopefully there's a... I'm trying to listen out to hear if I can um, hear any mobs, but I can't. Nope, I thought I could hear some water. Well, we've got plenty of coal. What level are we on now? Nine. Okay, well, we're basically at bedrock and we haven't found a cave. Well, that's quite surprising. Maybe... Okay, well, now I'm down here, I might as well... I think I'm just going to mine a bit of this coal. There we go, that'll do. Then I'm going to work my way back up. Grab this iron. Should mostly be smelted now. How are we doing? Okay, yeah, 11 ingots, so... Um, I'll make myself another pickaxe. And then maybe I can make myself a piece of armour. Perfect, another pickaxe. Um, I'll make myself some leggings, because I have got some more in there. Or should I make... Mm, no, maybe I'll make myself a chest plate. There we go. Just because of that protection. So there we go, iron chest plate. And we've got a bit of bit of iron equipment. <laughs> You're not going to be able to see me down here, it's quite tight. Um, but yes, there we go, that is the first episode, guys, of this brand new Minecraft survival series. If you want to see more, leave a like. And subscribe if you're interested in watching the rest of this series. Hopefully I should be uploading maybe three to four times a week, depending on you know how busy I am. But I am on summer holidays at the moment, so I've got a fair amount of time on my hands. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video, guys. And uh, I'll see you in the next one.